hello good morning or afternoon or evening whenever you're watching this video thank you for coming on over it's been a little while since i filmed just because me and the babies have come down with another horrible coldy coffee situation which has not been fun the babies have been okay in themselves very smiley still but yeah just been really snotty they're really coughing which is really sad um but yeah we're doing all the things that we need to do to try and get them feeling back to their normal selves um but yeah you can probably hear my voice is still a bit croaky but i thought i'd pick up the camera today i filmed a couple of bits recently that i thought i'd just um slide into this video so first there's a little clip of us walking around near our new house which fingers crossed that will all be happening fairly soon we went to strawberry fields well we went to new house farm shop the other day and they have uh, strawberry picking so we went there the other day the babies and i with katie and briny which was really sweet so i'll pop that footage in here um as well on this sunny saturday very sunny saturday we have come out for the afternoon and we're walking near our new house. I thought I'd bring the camera along to remember our little stroll. We've got a baby each and James has got a doggy. Percy was just very sad in the car for some reason. But he's feeling a bit happier now. This is the road that we live on. Uh, it's got the for sale sign outside. Oh, look, James. What? Look at that post box. Yeah. How handy is that? As if there's a post box literally there cheeky little post box on our road walking we just found a little allotment although our garden probably is big enough for us to borrow a little allotment sleepy boy we're both a bit sniffy still not sure if it's hay fever or coldy the babies had their jabs yesterday so yesterday was a bit of a sad day but it was nice day cozy cuddles is Sheppy see the cat all of these houses are so old I'm getting some inspiration the front like this one was built in 1900 crazy that's an old door and windows hello good morning oh long time no speak hopefully my voice will warm up a little bit We've been a bit coldy over in this house. My voice is still not quite there and I'm quite bummed up, but and these babies are also feeling a bit coffee and coldy, but um, the weather's really beautiful today. Brownie's coming down and I thought it would be a really nice day to try and vlog. Um, we're gonna go strawberry picking um, and yeah, make some memories, aren't we babies? Hey, you gonna do a smile? Let's take these off. Let's take these off. Are you gonna do a smile? Are you? Can you smile for the camera? Say hello. Oh, bless you. Oh, that's on his face. Say hiya. Good morning. Yeah. Good morning cheeky chops over here anyway time to get up time to get going we'll see if we start feeling a little bit less snuffly today hello there <laughs> we're going to see auntie katie and we're going to see auntie bernie today yeah oh, i can see some cheeky little ones down there oh look at this got a little pail. Would you call that a pail? I can really see. Oh, the breeze. Are you having one? Straight in.
Well, we've actually been going through a bit of a heat wave at the moment in England. Well, at least where we live in England. Um, very warm. And poorly babies in the warm is not fun. So yeah, they've been living in vests and just lots of thin layers. We've been getting outside, enjoying the weather, but also having some chilled time at home, just in the cool as well for Shep. Um, it's just too hot for her outside at the moment, so we're just having some chilled time at home as well. So today I thought I'd try and get in the garden because it really needs sorting out. We've got lots of bulbs which need storing um, because we've got some tomatoes to plant. So yeah, I thought I'd just film the garden and show you what we get up to. We also need to start packing up the house soon, so I might be I might try and film a bit of that at some stage. Yeah. Let's go and have a little look in the garden and see what we can get up to. Okay, so this is our garden. We've been very lucky while we've been in our little house to have this little space. It's a very tiny little garden, more like a courtyard. Um, and as you can probably hear, the road is literally right next to us, so that was you know one of the more negative points about the house but the positive out the positives outweighed the negatives and actually we get used to the sound and the noise it's just when you're in the garden it can get a little bit noisy i don't know how well you'll hear me hear me but anyway so i'm in the garden and i'll just have a quick show of what i need to sort out um it's pretty bad let me show you we've got our greenhouse which hasn't really worked again this year We've got tomatoes, which I need to put into pots. That's a chilli over there, which is just about surviving, but honestly, I think it's gone. And this as well. <laughs> They're all just not really working. There's our poppies as well down here, and some of these have survived and some of them have not. These were indoor plants that I'm trying to revive. That's a fail. Our lime tree is looking very sad and sorry for itself. Is it alive? No, that is that is dead this which my dad kindly brought over that's thriving <laughs> some nice um, pansies I don't know what that is but just a nice plant <laughs> the washing just in the way which I'll take in this is our agapanthus which is growing beautifully so that will start flowering soon we've got potatoes which are doing okay but I need to fill up fill them up with some more soil so that's on the list of things to do. You right, Sheppy? Have you come to see what we're doing? Have you? Good girl. Oh, it's flying on me. Then we've got hanging baskets here, which are very dead. That's what I need to get the I need to get the um, bulbs out. And this trough as well, just sad. Um, so I need to sort that out. Um, sad. I need to sort that out. Shep's had a dig. Rose is doing really nicely though. That's looking pretty. So, yeah, I've also got rosemary, which I need to give a water, I think. It's looking a little bit dry in this weather. So yeah, I'll do the washing, find the bulbs, get them dried, and then we'll pop them in a nice box to store. That's the plan. Let's see how we go. Hung the washing in, but Look who's joined Daddy in here. Is it an Edie girl? Did you wake up? You had a quick cat nap. You're going to go back to sleep in your chair for a little bit. 
Oh, sleepy girl. You can look at the moon and the star if you like. There you go. It is very warm out here, and it's operation. What can we get done before the babies wake up? I mean, Eden is awake. She's chilling with James. So they're gonna need feeding soon. But I've collected these bulbs. These out of this trough. Shep's having a good sniff of these baskets, which needs sorting out. I just cleared some pots over here. Um, yeah, gonna wash these and then put them in like dark, cold storage and then hopefully in like autumn winter time we can plant them in our new house. That's the plan. This was just not the right sort of thing for tall like daffodil so we'll put something else in there. You right Shep? What have we found? Having a great time. Cough, cough, cough. Row, row, row your bell. Hi. So we got to a point in the garden and then babies woke up and then dinner happened and then bedtime happened. Um, but I'll show you what, where I got to. Um, I'm now wrapping James's Father's Day present because he's out at band. Hoping he doesn't come back before I finish. I'm looking forward to us all feeling a bit better because these colds are not fun. I feel the babies have got their second lot of jabs tomorrow as well. So I'm really hoping that they don't get too affected by that either. Now, this paper, there is more than enough paper, but like, not in the right places, you know what I mean? So it's not going to be very well wrapped, <laughs> but we'll give it a go. This is terrible. Oh. I'll come back in a minute when I've made some sort of something out of this. Right, we've got somewhere. We're here. I've turned it upside down because I feel like you can't notice the bad wrapping that way. Present wrapped, ready for Sunday because I don't know when James won't be around now. That's done. Very thirsty all of a sudden. I made a little smoothie because it's kind of like ice cream but healthy version, just using frozen fruit from the freezer. <laughs> um, I'm gonna write the card now and then I'll show you the garden. Okay, so this is what I've done. I have sorted out this trough, got these ready for planting, these ready for washing, these ready for planting up, this ready for planting up, they go up there, add up there, and that's for the tomatoes over here. These ready for planting, these look very sad, so I need to sort them out. Box for bulbs, some bits over here ready for planting. Dad gave us the lettuce the other day. Check these just here. These ready for planting and reviving. Um, yeah, that's where we got to. So maybe at some point this weekend, we'll go to the garden centre and see what little bedding plants we can find. So that was today, feeling very tired now. I'm gonna sign off here for tonight. Thank you for watching. Like it if you like it, and subscribe if you're not already, and catch up again soon. Goodbye.